Hey, I'm Spencer Ware, co-founder and CEO of Repower. At Repower, we firmly believe that trailers play a critical role in the future successes of supply chains. Did you know that the average trailer spends about 75% of its lifespan detached from a power unit? That means that trailers on average are, are not generating revenue 75% of the time and generating revenue about 25% of the time. We get it though, managing trailers is a, is a complex operation and oftentimes trailers sit idle for weeks, if not months. That's why we created Repower. Our universal trailer network is the industry's first shared trailer network. It brings much needed flexibility to the world of trailers by streamlining and optimizing the use of trailers across multiple carriers. Let me show you how it works. So within Repower, um, you can view all, all of the trailers in your fleet um, by trailer number, by body type, uh, their status is available. Um, you can see the last known location from telematics that you can connect and repower. Um, and then on the right hand side here, you can see uh, the last time that telematics updated the location. Um, so if I wanted to list this first trailer here and make it available, uh, it's been sitting idle for, for weeks uh, at my terminal. Uh, I wanna make it available. I'm gonna create a listing here. And so it's gonna auto-populate um, the location. Um, I have 11 trailers there. They're dry vans, I wanna list one. Um, I wanna add a drop-off location in Dallas, in Chicago. Um, we have a dynamic pricing algorithm that'll, that'll calculate the daily rate of a trailer. Um, so we've taken care of the pricing for you. Uh, we recommend maximizing earnings by the daily rate by using the repower price. Um, this listing will always be available for pickup until it's reserved. Uh, we see the most success with trailers that are available for minimum about 14 days. Uh, maximum, that's up to you, but we recommend 14 to 16 days. Um, you put in a trailer interchange limit. Uh, typical is 40 to 60,000. Um, so we'll add 50,000 there. You can add any pickup instructions you like uh, or any other pickup details. Uh, but from there, hit create listing and it's live. Um, so renting carriers, uh, owner operators, other carriers can go on and, and search for trailers uh, in that area. And yours uh, is shown on the marketplace, public marketplace to be able to book. Um, so from here, um, you can go into reservations and you can manage reservations that are pending, upcoming, active, and historical reservations. So just going to click into a historical reservation um, and show you the chain of custody uh, documentation for an old reservation. You can see um, owner of the trailer. You can see where it was picked up, where it was dropped off, the dates, um, and you can see the pickup inspection form that was submitted at pickup. Um, you can see which trailer the carrier picked up, the condition it was in um, through the pictures here, and they give it a rating as well. And this we found really valuable to establish chain of custody, uh, which when you have third party carriers hauling your trailers, uh, can be pretty cumbersome and complex. Um, other than that, you've got interchange documentation here uh, insurance, COIs, and uh, the interchange agreement there. Um, you can message the company back and forth and coordinate pickup details um, or anything that happens through the reservation process. This is only the beginning for Repower, and um, we are very well positioned to help the industry as a whole optimize uh, the use of trailers by equipping fleets uh, with an on-demand network that moves as fast as the market uh, changes. And so fleets that prioritize a more of a trailer-centric strategy today 
uh, with Repower, we'll have significant leverage in years to come. Thank you.